Hi. Hi and welcome to how to feed your... <laughs> Hi and welcome to how to feed your social media monster. My name's Richard Willett. I'm the media content manager for success4.com and today we're going to talk about Yoda posting. Nothing more will I teach you today. Clear your mind of questions. What is Yoda posting? I'm going to tell you in the next bit about Yoda posting and what it is in the next bit. <laughs> a bear upstairs. Is there a bear up there? Yeah. Sometimes I lay in bed at night and I can't sleep for all the ideas that are going through my head hole. The videos that I can make for my YouTube channel and some nights I can't sleep because I'm worried and I'm worried about the ideas not coming, about me not being able to feed my social media monster, about it getting very skinny and then dying through not being fed. So I go online, I come down here to this corner here, which is my only bit in the house I'm allowed to sit in, and I look online, and I search, and I look for inspiration and motivation. And what do I find? What do I find? What do I find? I find thousands, hundreds and thousands and twenties of thousands of pictures with text over the top, beautiful font types, all poetically, scribbled across the top and they make no sense they make no sense now just because something said poetically doesn't mean it makes any sense at all and this is yoda posting let's have a look at yoda and see what yoda does master moving stones around is one thing this is totally different no no different only different in your mind only different in your mind. Alright, I'll give it a try. No! Try not! Do! On the computer, not looking at boobs. So what Yoda seems to do, is he takes words, he switches them round, puts them backwards, and they sound more mystical and clever than they actually are. The boy you trained, gone he is. Consumed by Darth Vader. Use your feelings, Obi-Wan, and find him you will. Now this seems to be done a lot, especially on Instagram, with people putting text over mountains. Now let's have a look at some classics here. I found some really good ones last night. So this is Yoda posting. Makes no sense at all. So what ones have we got here? People may hate you for being different and not living by society standards, but deep down, they wish they had the courage to do the same. What? The people, aren't you society? Who is society? Aren't you one of them? Telling them that they're different but you don't like it. So get in line and then they want to do the same as you. So everybody's in a rowing boat going down the streams in the little rowing boat in the Norfolk Broads. Moving on. Actions always prove why words mean nothing. Action. It is written in words. Actions always, always, every single bloody time. Prove why words mean nothing. What about the next one? Sounds mean nothing without music. Jerry Goldsmith. This one's... <laughs> Clothes mean nothing until someone lives in them. Now, I have tried to live in the same pair of pants for the last six months, but Sam won't let me. I'm gonna, this is proof that she is wrong and I am right, and these pants mean nothing until my sweet ass is in them. Clothes mean nothing until someone lives in them. Lives. Like a house. Right, now, uh, um, oh, this one's, uh, yeah. Never be defined by your past. It was just a lesson, not a life sentence. Unless, in your past, you've murdered quite a lot of people and that is definitely a life sentence, maybe quite a few life sentences. But don't be defined by the, the murders that you've done because that's in your past. 
and there's nothing you can do about it so don't be defined by it just just move on don't do it again let it go bloody hell so my point for this video is just put some um, fancy text over a picture it's not great content you can come up with much more creative ideas and ways of doing things people read that stuff and it's just funny a lot of the time a lot of it doesn't make any sense just switching some words around doesn't mean that you've made <laughs> a life-changing statement um, and then the worst one is when people say it's open to interpretation why are you writing anything it's like saying that song's that singing's not out of tune it's just you're hearing it out of tune what guys please remember to subscribe to success for global on youtube and all social media platforms check out success there's a how to feed your social media monster every monday and every sunday we do covert coaching so please subscribe